Hello, everyone. I am sure you are wondering why I am on a boat today. Well, I am going to teach you a story about Jesus while on this boat. Did you know that Jesus had to teach people from a boat one time because there were so many people? Well, he did. The crowds stood on the beach while he told them a parable from his boat. If you remember, parables are stories that Jesus taught to help us understand things he wanted us to know. Would you like to hear one today? Well, one day, a sower went out to sow. A sower is someone who throws seed on the ground and hopes that it will grow. As he sowed, some seeds fell along the path, and the birds came and ate them. Other seeds fell on rocky ground, where they did not have much soil, and immediately they grew, since they had no depth of soil. But when the sun rose, they were scorched, and since they had no root, they withered away. Other seeds fell among thorns, and the thorns grew up and choked them. Other seeds fell on good soil and produced grain, some a hundredfold, some sixty, and some thirty. Now, this was not a story about growing plants. The seeds are the teachings of Jesus and the Bible, and the soil represents the people who hear the word. The people who are the good soil learn about Jesus and follow his teaching. We want to be good soil. The bad soils are the types of people who hear about Jesus, but either do not listen or do not take what he says to heart. All right. Well, we have a question this week, and the question is, why did God make water? Well, that is a wonderful question, and the answer is Kind of simple. God made water because we as people need something to drink. He also made water for the animals and for all of the plants. And did you know that there's water up in the clouds so that it might give us some shade and also provide rain? God knew that we would need water, and so God made water. Thank you so much for this question. I look forward to more questions next week. Just remember, Jesus loves you.